Hey guys, this is Beast Point, and today I am back on Grand Theft Auto 5 Online, and in this video, I will be showing you the duplication glitch. So, what you need is you need an MOC with a personal vehicle storage, you need to spawn at your bunker, and you need a penthouse suite, one of these ones that are here, it's from like 905,000 to like a million and something I'm not completely sure but you buy those on dynasty and what else you need you need a nightclub garage a casino penthouse garage or an arena garage because that is where you'll be transferring it and to the g garage that you are going to transfer your vehicle to you want to buy an LG RH8 and put it in there so let's get right into the video so what you want to do is you want to have the car that you're duping in your MOC storage I recommend either a fully upgraded Benny's cars like the LA Retro Custom or a fully upgraded arena vehicle like this one. I'm pretty sure that this one sells for the most. So that is why I'm using this one. <clears throat> okay, so what you want to do is whenever you pull out your vehicle from the MSC, you want to bring it over here and by this wall is where you want to park it. You want to park it up against the wall and make the front of the car touch the post just like I do and you will as you see on the top left corner of your screen it says press right to store this vehicle and that's what you want and whenever you do that you just get out and you run outside okay so once you get outside as you can see when you press your pause menu there's jobs all over the map and what you want to do is you want to go to a job that is close to your penthouse so I use this one so what you do is you wait till it shows up you press square to start the job and you, whenever you're doing this glitch you want to be in a free game session because you have to join another player like one of your friends okay so when you load into the job all you need to do is press home and you need to join a friend I'm gonna do that right now Okay, as you can see, it says getting GTA Online Session Details. You want to accept this alert and decline this one. And as you will see, it will take you out of the job and spawn you right here. So whenever you spawn out of the job, what you need to do is you need to get a pedestrian's vehicle. Oh, my lord. You need to get a pedestrian's vehicle and drive it to your penthouse. You cannot use a personal vehicle or it will mess up the glitch. Okay, so once you make it into your penthouse, what you need to do is you need to head over to your heist planning room and make sure you have a setup. Okay, so what you want to do is you walk over to the heist setup board. You want to hold your pause button and then you press right on the D-pad and then as soon as you do that, you want to let go of the options button so you are in the pause menu but on the heist planning board. Okay, so what you want to have it like is this and right here... What you need to do is you need to go over to online, go down to the criminal enterprise starter pack, go load into this and then just back out of it. Then from here you need to hold your interaction menu, go to apartment style, go down and start pressing X and as you can see it will glitch and you will get a black screen. But what you want to keep doing is you want to keep going down and press X to where you get the black screen to stop appearing. See, as you can see, I am cycling through it and pressing X and it is not getting black screen. So what you do from here is you just back out. And as you can see, I have no minimap and that is what you want. If you couldn't get it here, I suggest closing the app and just or going to creator and starting a whole new invite only session. Okay, so from here, once you get the no minimap, you want to press pause, go into your map and as you can see, it says switch view. You want to press switch view and as you can see, all the jobs are here. And then you need to spawn in the job closest to your casino because that's where I'm doing it. But if you're doing it in like any other spot, you need to spawn closest to that. So as you can see, mine is, I'm doing the casino, so I'm going to start this job and back out of the job. Just like when you did it first, you want to accept the first alert and decline the second one. So it will spawn you out of the job and next to your casino. 
Okay, so from here, what you need to do is you need to get in your free LG RH8, and whenever you and you want to pull it outside. When you pull it outside, you should spawn without a vehicle, and if you spawn with the vehicle, you need to restart the glitch. Okay, so from here, what you need to do is you need to go to your a job close to your bunker, like these ones. What you need to do is you need to start it up. What you need to do is, of course, you need to go to your home screen and join a friend in a different targeting mode. And, of course, you need to accept the first alert and decline the second one so it will spawn you out of the job. So, from here, what you need to do is you need to run over to your bunker. And you will be running slow because it still thinks you're inside. And you need to run over to the car that you have parked right here up against the wall. What you need to do is you need to get in the car. As the top left, you could see press right. What you want to do is you want to press right to store the vehicle, and it will say personal vehicle storage full. And you want to OK, because that is how you duplicate the car. So now, if you've didn't done it all correctly, there shouldn't be the car that you duplicated, and it should be at your casino, your nightclub, or your arena garage, whichever one you used. But that is how you duplicate it. I will get over to the casino to show you the car. I made it to my casino garage. All I need to do is run over here and as you can see, the car has duplicated. There is one I did earlier and here is the one that I just showed you guys. Okay, so this is the one that, this is the spot where the Elegy RH8 was and now there is an Issy Classic here. And this you can sell if you have plates. This is, you need custom plates, or else if you sell it without plates, you will pop up on Rockstar's radar, and you might get banned. So I don't recommend selling it. I just wanted to show you guys. I do not have custom plates, but I just wanted to show you guys this glitch for all the people that need money. So, if you liked this glitch, make sure to give this video a like. What you want to do is subscribe if you're new, of course. Um... But that is it for this video. I hope you guys have a good day and peace.